So I'm going to do an MRI on you. What? Yeah. It won't hurt your stomach because it's actually... The only things for this MRI is basically you can just lay down on your back or stomach. We're doing it so you can lay down on your stomach. You can't move anything. Well, the only things you can move is your eyeballs. Why do I need an MRI? Because, um, remember in that last video, we saw that I, you have cancer? Yeah. What? We, re, we, we recorded it. I said I have, you have cancer. So that's why I'm doing it. Where do I have cancer? In your throat. In my throat? Yes. So, I have to get an MRI? Yeah, because that's how we have no other things in this universe for, like, x-rays or anything. So, MRI are the only things that we can have in this universe to do for x-rays. To detect cancer? Yeah. And that's the only things that help the cancer in, in the body. And anything else doesn't have, like, allow cancer and stuff. So, you're going to do, how's the MRI work? Well, this MRI is the same MRI as I had. Okay. So, that's how it works. <laughs> well, tell me. I don't remember. So you put the ear things inside of each ear, and then you put the headphones on top of those. Uh-huh. So then that makes the sound disappear. Earplugs and headphones, uh-huh. Yeah. And then they li they leave you on the bed with a little sheet, and then they push the bed spot in like that, and then they do the x-rays. And you can watch a movie or anything. Mm-hmm. You can do anything, but only move your eyes. Okay. And and then what happens? And do I have then, to get a shot? Well, not in the throat. Oh, good. Well, you do have to get a shot, but it has to be on either arm or legs. But it has to be on the arm up here where my pointer finger is. What's the shot for? It's to help the blood get into that cancer to make you still alive. Do I need to go get some tools for it? You need tools? Yeah. Oh, you always want tools. What tools? I need the earbuds and headphones. For oh, it. right, for my MRI. Yeah. Any so I'm going to go get them real quick. Any other tools? Is that it? Um, If you want to watch a movie... Then I'm going to go get that little machine thing that goes around the head. And it's like a little mirror that you can see the movie. Oh, okay. So I, that's another tool I'm going to get. Anything else? Nothing else. Nothing else. So, roll onto your stomach. Okay. Okay, so I got the stuff on you now. Mm-hmm. Now, you have to do... You have to just put your head down. Okay. Just flat. Mm -hmm. The only thing you can move around is your eyes. Mm -hmm. The mirror will be in front of you so you can see the movie. Okay. So, now what I'm going to have to do is I am going to have to slide you in the MRI mm -hmm. machine. Okay. Yep, which I'm going to do right now. Okay. And then what? And then what's going to happen? I'll do the x-rays. Is the machine going to hurt me? Well, no, because they'll just make sounds that the x-rays are doing. What kind of sounds? Like, sweetie sounds like, tweet, 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 like that. And then kind of like car sounds. Car sounds? Yeah. Like what? More like that. Okay. And some more other things, yeah. I don't need to be afraid of the sounds? No. Okay. Well, you might hear some of the sounds, mm -hmm. but you won't be afraid of them. Okay. Okay. I'll slide you in. Slid in now. I'm slid into the MRI machine now. Almost. Okay. You're almost slid in. Anna had an MRI on her 
lat muscle in October of 2019. Last October, not this October. So she was three, so almost four. Like she was about to turn four at the time. So she was three, almost four years old when she had the MRI. Okay. Now Just I'm that one time. I need to go get my laptop today. <laughs> she remembers pretty much everything, it seems like. I remember anything from MRI. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go in another room. Okay. And then I'm going to have to check out the machines. Please. You have to be very quiet for this. Okay. Because he's asleep for now. Because of the MRI. She's gone into her bedroom. Oh, you guys are my movie. Yeah, her memory and her recall has always been crazy. Like ever since she was born, she just remembers things so well and so easily. I'm I'm ready. Are you ready? Okay. There's actually a, a video. We did a we I I did this whole um I prepared her for the MRI. We looked at videos what it was going to be like and I even uh ran through like a pretend MRI with her at home before she had it done so that she would be well prepared for what was going to happen. And you can find that video on our Facebook and our YouTube channel. Um, the easiest way is probably just go to Google and type in AMC Princess Anna MRI. And it'll come right up. And you can watch it. It's pretty cool. Especially if you if you know a child or you have a child that's going to have an MRI. It'd be a, probably be a good video to watch. But um, her MRI was to detect, to see if there was enough lat muscle to um, do the lat to bicep transfer. So Dr. Feldman's going to transfer lat muscle from her, you know, back. Your lat muscle is like kind of under your arm, but into your back a little bit. He's going to pull muscle out of there and transfer it into her right bicep. So she can have the active ability to bend that right arm up to her face. So she can feed herself and brush her teeth and brush her hair and wash her hair and wash her face and all those good things. Um, so they had to do an MRI to make sure that there was muscle to transfer, you know, cause you don't want to just wait until you put them under general anesthesia and open them up to find out. So he did find that there's enough muscle to do the transfer. So we're and just, I can turn the it sounds on <laughs> to make the x-rays work. We're just waiting for, COVID to abate so we can get that surgery done. She's making Those are the noises you're gonna hear. Okay, that's not too bad. <laughs> Those aren't too bad either. Okay. MRI is done. Yay. Okay. How did it go? Really good. So actually, I have some pictures that I took screenshots of. Okay. So, I'll show them to you. So one of them is this one. Oh, what is that? This is the skin layer. Oh. Is that supposed to look like that? It is, because that's what the part of the skin is. So there's nothing wrong with my skin layer? Well, do you see the middle part by the mouth? Little? Mm -hmm. That part is a little red. So that means that's where the cancer was. Oh, did you get it out? Did Or how do we get it out? Well, you have to take surgery now. I have to have surgery now? Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah. This is turning into such an ordeal. Yeah, it is. Because you have to have an MRI for cancer. What about, what you about? You have to have surgery. Oh. Then you have to have physical therapy. Oh. Then you have to go home. 
What about the cancer in my throat? The throat cancer is already done. You already got the surgery and therapy for that stuff. Oh. <laughs> well, that was fast. So, I don't even remember it. Look at the other pictures. Uh -huh. Give them the other pictures. So the other <laughs> one is this one, uh -huh. which is the muscle layer. Mm -hmm. And that one, it looks like there's a little bit of a broken muscle. My muscle's broken? A t little tiny bit of it. Looking up close. What do I do about okay. that? Right there. Well, you have to have surgery for that, too. Oh, boy. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> it's all about... It's all in the cancer part, I'm x-raying. Okay. And then the third layer I took a picture of, or a few pictures, that was the bones. Okay. There was no broken bones or anything, but you can still see a little bit of the redness right there. Got it. Yeah. So the surgery will take care of the broken muscle and the cancer. Yeah. Got and the it. physical therapy will do that too. Nice. Okay. Well, the physical therapy won't help the broken muscle, but that's what the surgery will do. Right. Yeah. The physical therapy will help me recover from the surgery. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So. All right. Well, I guess next time will be surgery. Today is actually surgery, too. Well, don't I need to make an appointment? You already scheduled all three appointments. Oh, so I'm going straight to surgery now. After we get there. Okay. Okay. We're also record that. Well, thank you for your help. You're welcome. I'm going to go do it now. <laughs>